I mean, he doesn't mind being in there a little bit. Like, definitely at night, I know if you guys watch the sleep scope and you hear him. There's just no way at night we can keep him out because, one thing, he just pees on everything. But it's just not safe for him because, like, he literally starts, like, behind the wall, he was starting to, like, chew through the wall because the mice had started it, and then I had to cover it up. But then there's, like, holes in the wall that have, like, cardboard, and he can, like, chew through the cardboard. So I keep having to cover things because he gets into things. So it just would not be safe if we were sleeping for the little guy to be out. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Huda. Thank you, everybody, for... Um, hey, I think the channel might be coming back. So why we were upset, you guys, is they were saying we weren't shadow banned, but then you could not get to our lives, like, at all. Like, it would be like... Because I do it every day when, when I'm driving home from the grocery store. Um, I gotta take my makeup off soon. When I wear makeup, it drives me insane, and my nose... Went, I hate it. Um... That's why I don't wear makeup more. As much as like I like it, so when I have the stuff in my eyes, it's so bad for my allergies. I used to think I had allergies until I stopped wearing makeup. And I was like, oh, I don't have allergies. It's just the makeup. I have allergies to makeup. <laughs> allergies to makeup. But anyways, um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, so when I'm driving home from the grocery store or, or even any other time when Richard's on a live... I see what it normally looks like. And for a while, it's been like, pretty much like if I go into our app, I'm gonna see right away, like here's Richard. Um, or if it's not even on the front page, then when like I go to the next page, like it's gonna be like, here's a big video of Richard. Um, it was not doing that for several days. It was like, you would go, you had to go to our profile, like all the way to our profile. And then it would have the little bit of the circle if you were on the profile. But then you'd even have to go to live. I don't know if you guys were, I mean, this is what I had experienced. And then maybe not with everyone. I had to go to the live button. And then it would have it just in a normal little video. Like where they show all the, you know, the layout of videos. And it would say live really small. Where now today, when I was coming home, it was back to when on the profile page, here's his big live video. Like literally showing showing it like in motion not just like a static photo thing you know um and a tiny little little thumbnail like thing so i'm really happy because i think that means it's kind of coming back so that's why we were people kept saying oh don't worry it's just a short time but we're like we hope it is what if it's like this forever and that would be a bummer if no one and then we also had someone email us saying they literally couldn't find our page at all like even when they searched it so they were saying there's no shadow ban but we're like that feels like a shadow ban you can't find this, you know. So, but it seems like it's gotten better. So, I need to vacuum this place. There is poo everywhere. He literally turd bombs the place. I don't know what that is. I guess. Well, Richard says no. Nope, here goes the question. Richard says that's kind of how they navigate. Is they poo and then? I, no, I'm just observing. I don't know for a fact. But it's, it's just, just a guess. Funny, they just poo everywhere. I mean, it's the best animal poo you can deal with because it's just these little pebbles. And when they're dry, they're really easy to just clean up. Like, I'm so much easier than a dog or with that nasty stuff ever. So I'm very thankful, but the pee gets annoying. <laughs> but I love them, so what are you gonna do? And I try to be not too harsh on an animal because he's a male and he's just trying to like mark his territory. He don't know no better. And he doesn't know, yeah, so you can't be like, Dude, but we, I do try to get him off the bed. Like if he's starting to pee on the bed, I, I pull him down and put him in this. Um, litter box, but he's uh, he's so spoiled. I, I can't discipline him in any way, uh, nor would I want to. Um, I don't think it's right to discipline animals. My stepmom used to hit my dog with a shoe when he would chew on the shoes, and I hated that. So he would go pee on her bed, and only hers because she hit him with the shoe. Like, so you're right. I won't ever discipline animals. It's like because for one thing, most of the time they're trying to tell you something. Like, he was been mad at me the last couple of days because he was out of the hay that he likes. Like, right now, he, he's out of it. I'm going to put some in there before bed. But a lot of... And, like, when we first got him, he was pissed off he didn't have a cage for the first, like, two days. Then we got... This cage was coming in the mail. And then he was happy when he was out of the cage. But then he was pissed off when he didn't have a litter box. And I kept... I'm like, why do you keep peeing on my bed, dude? But he was like, what, you expect me to pee in my bed? Because I didn't think about... He doesn't really want to pee in his cage because it stinks. So he wants like a different place to pee. So that's what he's trying to show me like, oh, you want pee on your bed? I don't want pee in my bed either. <laughs> and I'm like, that's actually really smart. Because <laughs> I finally figured it out when he kept peeing on my bed. Because literally every time I let him out, he darted and peed like right on my bed where, like, where I lay. And I was like, dude, what's your deal? And then I got litter box and he's like, yeah, much better. That's right. 